With a refueling vessel alongside, Victoria stood by awaiting the embarkation of 801 Squadron with Mark II Buccaneers. The famous carrier was recently recommissioned after a short refit. She now has the first frontline unit to be equipped with the new Buccaneers. In command, at an early age for such a rank, is Captain D.L. Davenport. He's only in his middle 40s. The Buccaneers were flown in from RN Air Station Lossiemouth. Buccaneers are a long-range strike aircraft, able to fly at great speed and low enough to avoid detection by radar. Sea Vixens, Gannets and helicopters are also carried on Victorias. Practiced now is a maneuver which incoming aircraft have to carry out if they miss the arrest again. They then have to go up again to try once more. No mistake at the second attempt. The arrestor gear is repositioned to receive the next aircraft. For takeoff, they use the steam-driven catapult, the Navy's means of getting airborne without a long runway, not the smoothest or most comfortable way of leaving the deck, but they think nothing of it. Firemen are always on duty during takeoff and landing operations. With her buccaneers and other strike aircraft, the refitted Victorious means more strength to the Navy.